Mike, it's been a while since we've uh, met up, but I'm um, looking forward to hearing more about the Virage. Let's see what the car does. So Nick, we're in a nice Virage now. Tell me a bit more about the cars. The great grand touring car. This is Aston's answer to the Bentley. Something which has road presence, style, comfort, and a grand touring capability. They are built by artisans, craftsmen if you like, uh, in the same way that a Damien Hurst or a, or a Warhol was produced in a low volume factory. Well, the Virage is, is a very comfortable car. You know, this is a car which you can get in and peel off a few hundred miles and not feel fatigued at the end of it. I think people are beginning to appreciate what these cars are all about. Fantastic value for money within the marketplace as we know it today. So they were actually designed, engineered and developed solely by Aston Martin. These are the very last of the hand-built cars. The first impressions are it's a fantastic cabin. Beautiful uh, leather quilted lining. There's a rather quaint PRND21 for what gear you're in. But let's, uh, let's see what it's like. Very smooth power delivery. But this is what Aston's about. It's about doing a long journey, effortless power, beautiful interior. I'm loving the interior, I think it's fantastic. The ride is extremely good and it's quiet as well. I'm impressed. There you have it, that's the Virage. Um, it's quite an unexpected drive actually. It's, it's more sophisticated than I thought and I think the handling and the ride is, is very nice. It's a very nice gentleman's GT which is what Aston are all about. It's a great car.